Hi everyone, this is Ants. Something exciting uh, today, at least for me, uh, I'm going to be talking about if you can use Java or Kotlin with Godot. Can you build games using Java and Kotlin with a, a good workflow and using the editor, the Godot editor? And yes, you can. You could absolutely build uh, Java and Kotlin games using Godot, and I'm going to show you that uh, today. And um, before I actually go into the details, how fast is using Java with Godot? Because one of my um, subscriber basically says, can you compare it with uh, Java speeds? So using the same uh, finding prime numbers, less than 2 million, um, the same algorithm, Java is within five to 8% of C++ uh, sp speeds. So it's like I predicted, it's just slightly slower than C++ but it is incredibly fast. It actually dips below four milliseconds. The longer I run the test, eventually it gets down to four milliseconds. So I'm gonna show you how do, how do you actually make uh, games using Java on the Godot game engine? Well, you use this project here and it's called uh, Godot Kotlin JVM. And it basically says the project is still in alpha, but I actually think that's been very modest and the reason why is um they converted the c sharp de facto kind of demo 3d demo it's called roboblast it's a third person shooter and they converted it into into kotlin uh right so they got it working in kotlin i mean if you this 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 demo here has um you know it's using the ford plus vulcan renderer um, it has it has everything uh, third person shooter, including foliage and and, uh, and like it has a lot of stuff. So if this is working, that's actually a good indication that things are looking good. Um, and the other thing is, in terms of the supported uh, platforms, um, it's everything except the web, right? So everything except the web is supported. Unfortunately, because I actually like HTML. Um, and when you build it, you could build it uh, and include the JVM, similar to like a jar file with the JVM if you're doing a libgdx project, but it also supports Graal uh, native uh, image. And, um, you know, it's, it's extra work to do, but it's possible to do the Graal native image and all that kind of stuff, right? So, yeah, I mean, it's looking good. And in terms of the releases, they support um, 4.2.2. And on May 7th of 2024, that was the latest version of Godot. So uh, 4.3 recently got um, uh, released. And so they're always going to be uh, kind of like a, a minor version behind, like, in, you know, 4.3 is out and they're, gonna, they're on 4.2.2. So that's the only drawback. And, you know, they're basically saying, hey, you know, it's still an alpha, but it's still possible, right? So, yeah, uh, let's go back to um, Godot over here. And as, oh, you, oh my God. So I ran it over and now it's at 3.71. It's basically um, as fast as C++ code. I mean, yeah, it, it's incredible. So um, let's go back to the main page. And yeah, here's um, one way to get uh, use, use Java to make a good old game. So I hope you enjoyed that and take care.